A lot of you guys have been asking me to set up a store page where you can browse Diplex seeded merchandise, so I have. The link in the description takes you there. As always, thank you so much for leaving a like and a comment on the video. Your support really helps me out. Let's start the video. Hey, what's up guys? Double Stir again. Welcome back to Star Wars Galaxy at War. It is Friday, and this is going to be the third Star Wars Galaxy at War video that I've uploaded uh, this week. Expect more gameplay during the weekend and, of course, next week. So I thought I'd touch back on the video that I uploaded yesterday, the urban battle uh, on Naboo in the city of Theed, to be exact. Um, I had a real derp moment because I recorded the video at 4 a.m. So, for the future, Diplex do not record videos after midnight, I said Anakin instead of uh, Qui Gon Jin, um, and I'm not entirely sure why I did that. I think I've watched way too much Episode Three because I'm so used to seeing Anakin and Obi Wan together. So that was a real derp moment. I mean, he was there, but he wasn't a Jedi to be exact. I believe he was like nine years old. Ah, uh, so unfortunate a mistake there. Hopefully, you can forgive me. I also said Palpatine uh, or Palpatine. Sorry. While it's meant to be pronounced Palpatine, um, that is mainly just because of a, uh, I guess, direct pronunciation from the spelling. Um, it's spelled Palpatine, but it's meant to be pronounced Palpatine. Um, and also, someone, actually, I'll talk about that in the next video, uh, which is going to be a Rob's Realism Mod video because it doesn't relate to my Star Wars content. So, if you guys want to see more Star Wars Galaxy at War, let me know what kind of maps you want to see, what kind of battles you want to see. If you want me to recreate some movie scenes or other things. Today we're doing a battle from the defense of Camino, the first CIS invasion. Uh, we've got some phase one, 501st, and this isn't, this is on one of the sort of uh, a platform area. I mean, it's a really nice looking map. Um, we're actually here to try and rescue a team of clones that have been stranded down here after one of their LAATs crashed. They've got a senior officer that we need to try and rescue too, a clone commander. So we've landed a platoon of uh, clones here using two LAATs, and the camera angles are a little hard to control because the map is, you know, on different sort of levels and altitudes, so it's going to go up and down a bit. But I'll try and stay over the the actual uh, platforms here that hover over the sea on these sort of small pillars. It's a really nice looking map. Whoever made this, really good job because it really does feel like Camino. I mean, it is Camino, so why wouldn't it feel like it? So we've got plenty of droids to fight and. I'm just overall excited. There might be a super battle droid or two involved in the battle as well. I can't exactly spot any, but there's definitely some, some senior droid commander back here too that we need to eliminate. He's standing right there. So, plenty of cool levels and different altitudes to, to watch and witness this fight in. Uh, without further ado, I'm not going to be talking for a million minutes. I usually get carried away because I like to talk to you guys. I like to inform you guys about my decisions and thoughts and updates and things like that. But most of you uh, come here for the pure action. So without further ado, let's uh, enable HUD and let's take control of the clone troopers. Phase 1, 501st. This is the first Battle of Camino. Let's watch this hopefully fairly intense firefight on somewhere on the planet. So let's start. We're going to go ahead and send our clones out. Look at this little platform that we can use as cover and also to get some good range and view over the enemy troops nearby. Let's see if I can position my men up near the corner there. Perhaps have them fire out. We'll see how that works. Really nice map design though. Alright, we've taken a few casualties here. And let me go ahead and take command of a section. We'll send them down the first first bridge leading down to the first level here down below. We're at one of the highest levels right now, so we need to make our way down. It's going to be a while, and we're probably going to be engaging a few droids until we can get to our stranded troops further away.
Isn't there a saying that it always rains on Camino? <laughs> because it's literally a water planet, so the condensation will <laughs> soak up everything. Uh, I'm not sure if it's called condensation. There might be a different word for when water gets sucked into the sky and through the clouds. Uh, but seeing as there's only water on this planet, then there's obviously going to be happening all, all the time, all around. Uh, there's another little platform here that I think we can use to provide some pretty good fire support from. I'm going to get some more soldiers down here. Move, move, move! <laughs> Hopefully you guys are enjoying the video so far. I think this battle is pretty, pretty cool. Love the rain, love the platforms, and love seeing the blaster fire all over the map. And now we're moving up some 501st troopers. And look at that. Good covering fire. Lovely visuals. Now we need to take, make use of the assistance that we can harness from that side. Bring out more troops to cover the bridge advance. Let's move, let's move, let's move. We'll be moving out troops in groups of four. Four and three. Really good visuals right now. This is what Star Wars Galaxy War is all about. Really cool, somewhat lore-friendly battles to really please all of you Star Wars fans out there. And people who are just generally looking for some pretty good firefights. Oh, that's cool. Nice. We're going to set up a perimeter right there. The rest are going to head up here. Secure the... Move up there and secure more of the inside of this place. Hmm. There's more troops along the side here. That is going to be interesting. Camera angles are a little hard to control right now. There we go. I love the new blood effects. Apparently people said that... Oh, look at that. I mean, obviously it's going to come out of droids because the game sees a droid as a as a human. Uh, I just, in general, I just like it. Uh, people say that with blaster fire, it's meant to be so hot to just kind of go right through you so that there's no blood. Because it, like, literally seals up the the sides of your in intestines and stuff like that. Like, you know how you burn, treat a wound uh, by simply burning the side of it to just stop it from bleeding? I presume that's what the blaster fire automatically does. Obviously, it probably kills you because it puts a hole right through you. But uh, that is pretty fantastic. We are going to have to hold out a little longer because the droids are going to be receiving some reinforcements. Uh, we need to set up our defenses and let's be prepared to receive them. We're going to retreat back towards the LAATs, though, where we can defend closer to our to our ships. The droids have received reinforcements, and it's time for us to tactically withdraw from this section on Camino. We're going to be pulling our troops back. A lot of droids have been landing. We need to evacuate the remaining clones here if we want to send troops out alive. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We have one LAAT remaining here. The other one took off with a superior officer that we needed to save. 
The rest, we're getting out. I'm afraid it's going to be hard to save everyone. We're taking lots of fire down there. This map is really hard to control. I was looking down there. I think we've lost them all. And all the droids are coming for us. I think it's about time to take off. There we go. That was a successful retreat by the remaining clone troopers. Hope you guys enjoyed. I think we'll have to tactically bombard this station here now that we've uh, evacuated the clones we came for. There are still droids remaining. Perhaps the Trade Federation will uh, remove them from the section, or they'll be left to die from some in, from some pretty se severe Republic bombardment. We're definitely going to not let clankers walk around here on, on our turf. But I hope you guys enjoyed this firefight and this uh, extraction and, of course, this... Uh, this emergency escape. I always like involving air units. If you guys want to see more of that, let me know. Maybe do some more air landing videos where we land clones in front of droids and, and have an awesome firefight. Next time, that might be the case. But as always, leave a comment and like, and thank you guys for enjoying the content, and I'll see you guys soon again. Bye!